Let's have these guys fire at will again, because they're probably going to come within range. Oh, did you see that? What a shot. That was an excellent shot. Which means it was probably an accident. But anyway... Okay, guys, welcome to the battle. So, the enemy is kind of retreating here, and I guess I should give a bit of an overview of the battle here. Because the enemy started off on the other side of this um, church plus monastery and associated buildings. I, I don't know. On the other side of this structure... Here, and I started off way over here, so I just moved my troops forward to here. And um, they apparently had troops like just standing on this hill here, and now they're retreating back towards the rest of their lines, which is a little odd. I don't know why they had troops all the way over here. But I think what I'm going to have to do here is actually move my army so that we're in this kind of field over here, facing the enemy. And hopefully stay far back enough that their catapult cannot fire on us. But anyway, I just wanted to bring you guys in because battle could be joined at any moment, and I wanted to give you guys the overview before, you know, something goes wrong and they just, like, start charging me while I start getting over there, and I didn't really have time to explain things. So I will bring you back once more as soon as uh, battle is joined one way or another. Okay, guys, welcome back once again. I've managed to get my troops more or less in the position that I wanted them in, where past the the building here and now i'm just kind of shifting my troops to the right as the enemy advances against us but it looks like they're not advancing all the way forward which is good What I'm worried about is that their catapult will come forward close enough that they can open fire on us, which would be a problem. Did I tell you guys to fire it? Well, I did. Okay. okay you guys just stop where you are, and then turn to open fire. What I would like to do is try and get some cavalry around their flank, maybe on this side. So that once their troops fully come, like, forward, we can just have someone go and quickly take out that catapult in the rear there. The Pavis crossbowmen really have to go. As do these longbowmen, actually. Or these, uh, crossbow militia. Oh, whoa, we lost five guys. Oh, well, we are taking fire from their side, so that could be why. Ooh. Poor guy. It'd be kind of nice if our catapults managed to accidentally hit their catapults while they're doing this. On hurry, my archers, kill them all before they kill too many of our guys. Of course, what we could do is charge our cavalry forward to kind of get them to, well, leave us alone. Problem is that I, then their catapult would open fire as well, and if we had like a dense, like bunch of cavalry, that would be pretty bad if they actually managed to hit us. 
or worse, their catapult fire would go over their heads, kind of like how mine is doing right now, going over their heads, and they would end up killing a bunch of our infantry or something. So I think this, this duel is pretty much what we're going to have to do. Unless... You guys get over here. If we come from the flank, then the catapult will fire on the flank. And so we won't be risking, like, the infantry or anything if we do that. Well, those guys are archers, too. Oh, those guys are routing! Here, you guys actually stop firing for a bit. Let the cavalry take them. Good, good, yes. Eliminate them. This very much in our favor. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. Oh, and here comes some more of their own missile units. Let's have these guys fire at will again, because they're probably going to come within range. Oh, did you see that? What a shot. That was an excellent shot. Which means it was probably an accident. But anyway. Wait, retreat. I heard them say retreat. They're withdrawing. Oh, okay. Cavalry. Forward. Um, archers. Don't fire at will. Alright. Attack those archers. Um, why don't you try and attack that militia there? Um, oh. I don't think we would want to engage the knights, to be honest. Alright, you guys, get over there and attack the catapults. You attack those... not those spear militia. Alright, get in there. Okay, good. We caught the catapult unit. Okay, you guys attack here. Okay, they're routing. Great. So get over here and let's see if we can catch this unit of feudal knights. Well, dismounted feudal knights. You keep taking them out. Oh, they're broken. Let them have it. Oh, there's an enemy unit over there. I was like, where the heck are these guys? Go and get them. Okay, look, we've been over this in the past. You guys need to, like, turn and attack the guys I told you to kill. Yes, like that. You see those three guys? Exemplary behavior on their part. Everyone follow their lead. You're surrounded. There's no escape for you three. All right, that takes care of them. Though it looks like there's another unit escaping through the trees over here. Ah, hello. 
who's going to catch who first? Because it looks like we've got our mercenary Frankish knights who are catching up with these militia over here. And that takes care of them, so that leaves these guys here. Oh, and these guys are also dismounted feudal knights. Good. We definitely want to eliminate them wherever we can find them. And again, they only had four guys left, so if they those four had managed to escape, they probably would have counted as a destroyed unit anyways. But regardless, who's going to catch them first? Is it the Frankish knights over there? Is it the mailed knights over there? Ooh, it looks like the Frankish knights are going to catch them first. Then again, they're taking a somewhat roundabout route to go and get them, so... That, that could cost them the victory here. No, no, it looks like the Frankish knights got them first. Yeah, I think the Frankish knights managed to get them all. Though the mailed knights, some of them got close enough that they might have gotten one of them or something. But I didn't see any of them, like, swing their sword or anything. So, that's the end of that. Oh, wait. What were total casualties? 31. That's excellent. Of course, a bunch of them did get away, though. In fact, about half... A little less than half of them got away, which is unfortunate. Ooh, that catapult. Look at how much damage that one catapult did. Or catapult crew did. The archers did pretty well. Cavalry did pretty well. Honestly, the, uh, the infantry didn't actually do any fighting at all. They just kind of stood there for the battle and looked menacing. But you know what? That's all they needed to do this battle. So let's take this right back to the campaign map.